B. Dalton's history began with the department store, Dayton's. Dayton's was based in Minneapolis, Minnesota and started in 1902 by George Draper Dayton. Bruce Dayton, grandson of George, opened a chain called B. Dalton in 1966. Born in 1918, Bruce got a job at the Dayton Company in 1940, working in the receiving room. He moved up in the company before opening B. Dalton, a company he named after himself but replaced one letter in his last name. The first B. Dalton store opened in Edina, Minnesota in 1966 and many more stores followed, most of the stores opening within shopping malls. Dayton hired Richard Hagen as the first president of B. Dalton. Hagen's experience was a department store buyer specializing in women's hosiery. Becoming president, he focused B. Dalton's on well-educated, younger, middle-class individuals. Having 12 stores in 1968, they expanded quickly and by 1986 there were 798 locations within the United States. Their stores averaged about 20,000 book titles including hardcover and paperback. They also carried games, vinyl records, greeting cards, and other novelty items. During the mid-1970s, B. Dalton's changed operation strategies to narrow their aisles and focus on the mass market approach. They increased inventory and now averaged approximately 25,000 book titles per store. Within the years of their expansion, they acquired Pickwick Books, a California-based company, in 1968 for $8 million and eventually merged into B. Dalton stores by 1976. B. Dalton also gained technology from its family company, Dayton's. B. Dalton used Dayton's NCR315 computer system, whereas they became the first bookstore to have a computerized book operations for their entire company. Keeping track of sales and inventory electronically, they were able to purchase books at a higher volume discount from publishers. By 1978, the 357 B. Dalton locations has combined sales of $174 million, passing Walden Books for sales even though they had fewer stores. In 1983, having previously merged Pickwick Books into B. Dalton's, they decided to open Pickwick Books as a discount book chain. By 1984, there were 22 Pickwick Book locations and each store carried approximately 7,500 book titles. 1986, Having 37 Pickwick bookstores, B. Dalton's announced they would be closing Pickwick's. A main competitor to Walden Books, and once the largest bookstores in the United States, B. Dalton's had increased competition from companies such as Crown Books Corporation during the 1980s and took business away from B. Dalton. Discount department stores and other book chains offering discounted books hurt business, so Dayton Hudson Corporation sold B. Dalton to rival and third largest bookstore chain, Barnes & Noble, in 1986 for upwards of $300 million. During the time of the acquisition, Barnes & Noble had 37 bookstore locations as well as 142 college bookstores. After the acquisition, and keeping the name B. Dalton, B. Dalton's acquired Scribner Bookstores in 1989 as well as Doubleday Bookshops Incorporated in 1990 for $20 million. Also in 1990, B. Dalton acquired Florida chain Bookstop. The same year, B. Dalton opened a different type of mall-based retail store called Software Etc., a company that will later become GameStop. By 1997, locations had been closing and there were 528 locations with 30 to 40 more stores closing with each passing year due to lack of sales. Sales for the combined B. Dalton group, which included the B. Dalton stores, Scribner's, and Doubleday, went from $732 million in 1991 to $509 million in 1997. By early 2010, Barnes & Noble closed the last 50 B. Dalton locations except for two stores. The final two stores in Washington, D.C. and New York would close by early 2013. Bruce Dayton passed away in 2015.